One of the unique features of Earthfin was its multiple revenue stream that integrate the use of fin tokens in real life. Wow, this, wow, this person, Aru, King the Dog, wow, highlight and bold the words on. What are the steps you've taken into consideration already, knowing that cryptocurrency is generally not widely accepted yet as of the moment? <coughs> so to answer this question, it has been taught right from the beginning that since cryptocurrency is not widely accepted yet as of the moment, all right, we don't intend to educate all right, crypto in general because first, it's too complicated all right, uh, with today's technology um, and most people don't really understand. So instead of trying to change consumer behavior, we want users to be able to buy it seamlessly and not even realize it's crypto. I'll give you an example. Okay, when internet started out, you know, the... the, the, the the internet technology companies all come out like, oh, suddenly it's, it, people know this is going to be future. Internet is going to be the future. But it's so complicated for the normal person, the little guy to understand. Oh, wow, Java, HTML, computer, wow, it's, it's so complicated. Now the company, right, it's the companies, right, that made it so simple that end consumers don't even need to understand HTML, Java, or the, or the complication of internet, all they need is a mouse, okay, to just move around and just click, 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 and they're actually using internet, all right? Th those are the companies that take it all. So personally for me, right, I believe that the blockchain company, the crypto company that can make consumers buy crypto and not even realizing it's crypto, that is the company that's going to take it all. And we, and Affin, right, okay, intends to become that company. We want to take it all. All right, we want to bring it into mainstream adoption. That is what we achieve. One, what, that is what we intend to achieve. I know the project has been has made its research on Earthfin's development and business model, which took a lot of brainstorming. What was the hardest part of making Earthfin into completion? Was it the game development, building a business model, and sustainability? Uh, okay, so the the biggest hardest part, right, was really the 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 sustainability of the game economy because. Everything that's something you can reference from, you know, you build a game, you know, you you geolocation it, your your lifestyle, uh, you know, uh, multi program platform. Everything has a reference point. The only thing that didn't have a reference point was the play to earn economy to make it sustainable. That was our biggest challenge. So we have been working on it for 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 more than more than more than it's we are supposed to, right? Uh, we have we have thought out. All the possibilities, right, of the game economy, how to keep it sustainable, um, and 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 we are proud that we overcome that biggest hurdle. Yep. So cryptocurrency is a network game. Yeah. Okay. Maybe back to that question, right? Um, this is really one of our biggest asset, the document, the blueprint of our game economy sustainability. That is our our biggest asset that we cannot cannot you know share out. This puts us ahead of every other play to win games. 